Oh god, Ray, I'm losing it at this Dutch announcer for the new Smash game. <laughs> <laughs> Ice pro. Ice pro. So, what does that say? Is this just 23? Is this 23? Mm. I mean, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna downplay Soji. He's not just some nerd. He's really cool. But. But she told he's hot. Yeah. I haven't had, uh, haven't had OCs like this in a while. Good. And not only is she hot, she's really good at OC, and they don't play her for fancer. Shocking, mm -hmm. I know. You think looking at that outfit that immediately they go hyper ham on it, but they don't at all, so. Yeah. A plus. Man, yeah, one of my favorite lines from Soji is still, uh, someone's, uh, hitting on Chitose, and, uh, I think Soji was like, I would be honored to kick your ass. Or something like that. <laughs> I would be honored <laughs> to kick your ass. Yeah. Who's white? ER. <laughs> Who's white? I like their big robot too. What's happening to you, Omai Kane? Nenma, a lot of it. It's almost time. Pop like, I'm in this thing. Ah! Let's walk over there and say, hey, Axel, what's up? Hey, Fchita, what's up? All this pussy footing around is screwing you guys. You heard right. Has it king lead yet? Wow, who's that in the back, Mel? Nine. Nine, 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 nine! nine. He's cute. No, he's the main character. Main character can't be bad. Yeah, he's right. Main characters can't be bad. Possible. I hate those guys. That's nine. She's Josie's girlfriend fighting Alfred. Everyone. What? What? I mean, I didn't hear you. Oh. Oh, they're girlfriends, because I said so. Okay. <laughs> no, they... They Take don't really... Care, they don't, they don't care anyone off in V. But there are several characters that joke about it in-game. <laughs> it's very amusing. We love Diablo. <laughs> I'm sure you do. <laughs> hey, don't jinx it. Hey, don't jinx it. So I'm DLC can actually describe it that moment? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do I mean? Now, DLC is the only reason that the joke exists. But there's a scene that you don't get if you don't have the DLC character where they joke about... Oh, well, those two are, but they're DLC characters. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about it. Shh. Let them joke about that solid gay. Dot dot dot. I mean, my master really tried to kill all humans on Earth. No big deal, right? <laughs> No big deal, right? Uh... Mr. Kashi, now you have the eyes of a true man. Let's say I mature just a bit. And where have we seen someone like that before? 
Oh my god, that dude's face. That's just boss. It's just it's boss. like that. Danger! Danger! Oh. Episode 20. Those unforgettable days. Oh, it hurts! I'm afraid of what that means. Oh, look it's at it. It's a Nesco title. A There's a bat! That's a bat. Not sure. Guys, look. Three. Oh? Pretty. Ah. Ah? Uh -huh. Give me one! No. Ah. Like Spencer here? <laughs> hey, jerk sock, where you get those robots? <laughs> I'll tell you where they came from. My bandbox hanger! <laughs> oh, you wish he laughed like that, Zach, but this guy's got an Ojo Sam laughing at I tried continuing laughing and said all I did was wheeze. I mean, <laughs> the same thing happens in the Jitose one, P Force, but the other way around. So, like. <sighs> Making sure everything's right. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. <laughs> Almost forgot. That would have been close. What scene am I thinking of them? Might have been like scenario like 30 something if you have the DLC early. Other girls end up talking about boys. And then I think it's like Lot. He's like, why don't you just have nine be your girlfriend? And Chelsea's like, what? What? And everyone chimes in like, oh yeah, that'd be fine. You two are already inseparable. I'm sure nine would be fine with it. What? <laughs> what? Say, so, yeah, let's go. Let's go down and greet those Gaspies, then, eh? Where's the wild? Got some wild physics. He's <laughs> got some wild physics, man. Woohoo! I'm a genius. Oh no! Base. By the way, I should show you and I, you can't stop me. My head cannon is stronger than you. Oh, race favorite Zockley's back. Yeah. It was out for a few maps. Gotta make sure to keep using it. It certainly is time for Chaos Dead MP3. Are you ready for Chaos Dead MP3? Hope you miss this game. Wait, why is Catra in the... In the Catra. Catra. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even five star, Ray. Why are you using it? Is that right? <laughs> Just... That's going. <laughs> Where's Camille on the bench? He's using Camille a four, he's using an SR. Cam Camille's uh, where he belongs. Bench is a man's name, and he's a man. Bench is a man's name, and I'm a bench. It sucks to suck to suck to suck.
Butt kicking springs lock and loaded. Oh, I know this map. This map is stupid. Good or grief. What a train wreck. Looks like we need more yada, yada. training. <laughs> Sweet, got him in a pincer attack. I'm sure I'll lose a buffet after this. About face. What? It's all about that. <clears throat> oh, my con A1 wobbles in the background. <laughs> Who asked you, Rory? <laughs> Wait, what? So, um, around, what was it, episode 12 of Nadesco? Um,. There have been repeated fights with uh, the UAF AF because uh, the Nadesco had to break away to go to break away from their forces to go to Mars, and everyone was like, "Yeah, let's." The UAF is no longer our enemy, but oh my, Kane, the Nadesco's onboard computer, doesn't figure that out because it's a self-learning computer and it still registers them as enemies, even when we tells them, "No, stop it," and uh, it opens fire on a bunch of uh, emissaries. Who are just who are just trying to make peace, and then we're and they're like and they're like oh fuck, oh shit, oh fuck. When uh, the Nesco got out of hand and wants a bunch of missiles, bringing down most of the emissaries. No casualties, fortunately, but a lot of uh, a lot of uh, ruined trousers. That's what the dub said. As a result, and uh, Ruri had to go ask for Akito's help to uh, go inside Omai Kane with the virtual with the virtual machine. And uh, rewrite the oh, help her manually rewrite the OS because once the UAF found about it, they were gonna they were gonna forcefully rewrite the OS. So they were she was just trying to do it in secret so they didn't know. Long story short, the 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 Nesco are enemies because Omoy Kane fucked up. Nice. That, that's what happened in the show. Or uh, maybe. I mean, with, with the devil gun of nonsense, you would think they would learn that. Uh... Those learning computers are bad. Ah. Thinking I... they learn is a lot of credit, Ron. <laughs> well, here we are. All alone with chaos. Yes. Can I have, just give me one game, just give me one, just one! <laughs> just one, please, please! I just want one dispense! So right, he killed the Nesco crew in this map, it's all fine, right? Yes. You can you can take him down, no problem. Cool, free money. Bless, bless on Nesco for extra money. Woo! Okay, give me a second. Uh... <laughs> uh... Oh, finally. You didn't spike their punch. It wasn't me this time! This is almost as good as those comedy shows on TV. So hey, uh, hey there, Zambot. Please don't get killed. Okay, thanks. Yours truly, oh, yours truly oh, oh, a, conser oh, oh, a concerned oh, citizen. Oh, he's not low guessing. Oh no. Yours truly a concerned citizen. Okay, fine. <laughs> you said you don't want it to die. Was that a fib? Are you messing with me? Oh, Melissa. <sighs> No fib, I, sw I swear to you. Fine, well, guts, I get it. 
Oh yeah, these are some good motherfuckers. Where he wants to control this stuff. They're large. Oh, 16. 15. You wanna show us the dispenser? Right? What? I was saying, you wanna show us the dispense? What? What's, they're no not, fat! They're not different since we last fought them. Really? Yeah. Oh, I thought they got more buffs. Come on. Nope. Same as before. Sucks to suck. Nah, they're just that. They're just dispense. It's just one of those days. And my last annoying now remark is don't forget to show off Alan B. This. <laughs> okay, sir. Quattro, please! Sure. Quattro, you can't do this. I respect your judgment. Whatever you say. Oh, Quattro. What will it hit? Find out today! That is the question. Eh. It's a really cool animation. That's oh, how it is. Oh, oh, I'm a big fan of the Double Gundam's animations. It's amazing. It's fucking Karate Sailor Moon, I love it. Tantrum. Oops. Ooh. Saucy. This is the way. This is the way. Oh wow. I actually hit that. Cry Sailor Moon, that's what it is. Hello. Hello. Trade the colonies for this. Stop this. <laughs> I united Neo Zeon for this. Armro, can you can you just can you just can you just kill me? Turn up, like uh, Armro. You just you just. <laughs> I'm gonna have Master Asia. Why don't you just see both? Yeah, let's have a. That way, Working you can do the Domon attack and then a Master of Asia attack and get all the combo attacks. Attack, 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 attack! Nice meme. I know you're speaking in terms of deployment slots. Use both anyway. Use both Deployment hands. Are a pitfall. There's Valor. <laughs> Attack with both hands. Chaos or Override Special Attack Teams? Yes. Welcome That's to right. Chaos. Welcome to Chaos. That's because it's they want to spread it. Well, oh no. <laughs> That By unit? the way, <sighs> he's here. So hey, what's up? Hey, Fujita. Playing OG two. What's up? What's up? Allow me to explain. This is what I normally say this time, but uh, oops. we're fucked.
Very, very simple. Indeed. They seem to be taken aback in my sudden appearance. You said that in OG2 as well. Yeah. The heck is a wiser gay in a beer brand? Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Hello? Is this thing on? Vindal, you're a smart man. You can figure this out. Blah, blah, blah. He said it. I'm... He said it. He said he said the thing. Mm. Mm. Amnesia. Okay. Amnesia. Amnesia. The dank descent. Afterburner. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess, uh, I guess this is pretty much OG2, except instead of, uh, Axel, we got Lom, yeah? Mm hmm. Yeah, this isn't awkward at all. So how absurdly broken is uh his Vindal? Well, once Ray gets a turn. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Ray? Ray? You'll see. Okay. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> They're quite enthusiastic about this. Please be gentle. <laughs> God, you gotta be kidding me. Damn you and your cheap tactics. Yeah, it has nothing to do with this. Jesus. <laughs> so the reason why the title is Oof! nice. So the reason why the title is, the title of the episode is called "Those Unforgettable Days" is because the reason why they wanted to uh, wipe all my content's memory uh, of the UAF, but uh, um, uh, Rui protested, is because the Omicani would forget everything it learned about the about the aliens, the Jovians, and all all it all it would, all it did from going to Mars, and wiping the memory would just undo all of the hard work they did just getting that far. And oh my god, he says the line when the episode ends. Goes on for double gaze, I will never forget. And then forgets. First scam. Oh, that's rough, buddy. Sure. Alright, then no. Oh, Fox, pal. Hey, generic soul games, what's up? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. If you had chosen the soul game, those would be generic ace angels. Mm. Yeah. I'd rather fight generic soul gains, to be honest. Same. That's just, actually rough, buddy. Just saying, TBH. So yeah, here's a generic soul gain. Ugh, it feels so weird to say. A generic soul gain. Look at this. Thirty-seven thousand HP, three hundred and fifty energy, one hundred ability, two thousand armor, and they all have HP and small. Nice. Like the soul gain itself, they are hard. It's got code, Kieran. Fuck off. They they play hard and fast, and yeah, they have kit code, Kieran. Wow. I wish they would use that one twenty well. Hey, big guy. Our final boss, ladies and gentlemen, Vindel Mauser in the Zweiser game. 
I believe Vindel here has 240,000 HP. Somewhere there. Um, he is also being helped. Hmm. Hmm. He leaves <clears throat> on turn six. If you can manage to uh, get his HP all the way down to zero before then, and you get and you have to do, and he leave, also leaves at uh, twenty-two thousand HP, you get that Haro. The Haro, if you're familiar with the custom CPU in uh, the OG games, it's the same thing. The Haro boosts uh, movement, armor, as well as uh, mobility. It's pretty crazy. Someone oh, a horror and watch him be god. Oh, uh, Chain hey, check out that skill. Double Because <laughs> he's the final boss, they had to make him threatening somehow, so they gave him double action. <laughs> That's what you think exactly what it is. He gets two turns for free. <laughs> Gale for. Prey level 7, prey level 5, counter hidden away at fight level 5. So, uh, the Zweiser gain is a buffed soul gain with mo with parts of the Vice Saga thrown in for good measure. And it's a strong thing. Byako Blasphemy, Seryu Stigma, both a normal version and a map version. I did range on this thing, how about that? Gembu Genocide, Night Edge, and Kirin Overlord. As you can see, this thing is quite powerful, Ooh. with like, 120 will, and 50 final hit. Go into the breach, ye of brave faith. Otherwise, don't and bother. And Rambo put a gain image in Metabots, I'm gonna put here. How many layers of mass production are you on? I don't know, maybe five or six right now, my dude. You are like a little baby, watch this. You are like a little baby, watch this. <laughs> Ah, oh, goddamn. We entered some shit, I'll tell you what. Oh, hey, took the smack. Texas Matt, take off. Shit! Shit! Lamia does not run in this fight. You're free to- you're free to- you are free to beat her up. Go and beat her up. Where are we at? Hmm? Where are we at? Oh, Where hey. are we run? What? Where are we run? Oh, it's Ace. Hey, Ace. Hi. I, I don't. Oh, there you are. I I was looking in the chat. I was like, wait, you're you're here, but you're not here. Oh, you are here. You're just, just blending into the background. Hey, Noble Gundam. All right, so uh, we're fighting guys from uh. Oh my god, her, her attack! Oh my god! Yep. Oh, oh my god! Ah! Oh. <laughs> I love that! Oh my god. Is she the Sailor Moon of this Gundam? She, she, she is. is. She has the ribbon, yeah. Yeah. Oh, anyway, so uh. TLDR Ace, we're in some deep shit. We're fighting the Nanesco units because their operating systems went berserk and they're trying to kill us. I can see that. <laughs> not, not by the free will, mind you, but yeah. Oh no, that would have made it spicy. By the yeah. free will. <laughs> yeah, and, and uh, we're also fighting uh, some enemies from fucking the same Hey, I'll learn Valor. Yeah. Yay. So, yeah, and, tell uh, me. we're also fighting this guy. What the f What do you think of Gale Force? <laughs> the robot? Double oh, wait, oh, wait. Or do you mean Gale Force the ability? Uh, yeah, what do you think of yeah. Gale Force? I thought Gale Force was fun if you just wanted to clear a map with one unit. Good! That's what Vindel has. <laughs> oh! Well, I guess <laughs> he better. Oh, what a coincidence! So does Vindel! 
Venom thinks it's fun to kill you all. It's not like a, it's not like a little gale. It's like a fucking hurricane force. Yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah, we're also fighting this guy, uh, his buddies, uh, Gispence, uh, Lamia and Angel G, and fucking mass produced soul games. Yeah, that's good because every time... Real kills, he's a rookie. Every time we're deep that's shit, ironic, we're deep shit. That's ironic. Give me Hey man, he's like a doe. The legendary prosecutor has never lost. My boy could not. Never lost. Ever. Because Ever. he's never played. Oh, he got us a kitty. What's that? So they can't eject until the mech is about to blow up? Mm hmm. Uh -huh. I was gonna say, you know, just just eject them. We have, we have to save them by beating the shit out of them. Ah. Wait, did they carry over stats that you put into them? No, they have their they have enemy stats for this. Oh my uh, god. Oh, hey, that reminds me of something I was gonna crazy. What happened? In Z, uh, we have a main character named Ran. And he's in, oh. a, in a very uh, rough looking super robot. Mm -hmm. And uh, generally, uh, when you go through Ran's uh, plotline, Mm -hmm. You can you, you can basically power him up and shit, but uh, at one point he actually goes crazy, and you actually have to fight him with uh, with some units that are probably not as upgraded. But the thing is, uh, he actually carries over the upgrades you gave to him. See, I was kind of the thing I equated this to, especially if he's a better unit than the others that are using in that map, right? It's yeah. Like, the people who play Pokemon and they only have their starter leveled up and then like the starter turns into the gym leader's Pokemon for one battle and you're like, wait a minute. You, you, you can basically screw yourself if you make him too powerful. Okay, yeah. I forgot, there's another game that maybe that made me go through a similar process. Which is also why I, I love leading my levels and stuff to things. Cause it, so I'm not over reliant on one thing. Um, but you know. I'm trying to remember, there was this one game where, uh, my friend knew that this character was gonna betray them, and, uh, he was all like, well, I'm just not gonna level her up then, and I'm like, but, but, but you really should, because she's really good. Yeah, that's not fun. Yeah. They gotta be at least challenging. So the betrayal stings a little bit, like, both gameplay and story-wise, you know? Well, there's a solution there, huh? Just don't use Ran. You know what? You're right. But I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Use that one guy. Oh yeah, it was Zeke. Fucking Zeke. I hate Zeke. What a dick. Ow. In Deering Saga, there's this good unit that is too good to be true. Because, uh, he's a Dark Knight. It's fucking ridiculous gross. Uh, he's got really big bases, and he's just overall overpowered. Sounds, it sounds like a pretty good deal, right, Ace? It smells too good. <laughs> and then you're gonna tell me something like, oh yeah, he has zero range in the attack? No, he just, he leaves you after a while, and then you have to fight him later. Of course you do. He comes with a devil lance and immunity backfire. Yes! He is immune to curse weapons, so he only gets all the benefits. There's a lot of benefits. So he uses a curse weapon without losing anything? Yeah. Oh, okay. More or less. They, they just that, have really good stats. It's kind of like someone knocking into your door and is like, Hey, you have free money? <laughs> if you're not suspicious... You know what I mean? Like, you, you gotta... You gotta... Taste yourself there. Yeah, fucking... The, you, you get free money, you take it, and it turns out to be like, uh, Monopoly money. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. no. It no, it doesn't turn to Monopoly money until you spend it. And then, like, the IRS or something shows up and he's like, wait a minute. Yeah. Well. Oh no! It's stolen bank money. And they track it to your house. Yeah. Hey. Is that a. Yeah, this is a goofy. It looks like a two headed soldier. Or two headed ogre magi with, like, soldier helmets, but then they were like, this thing's more guns. Yeah. I almost thought that said dragon. It's like a, a dragon. 
<laughs> it's like a, it's like the Kingdom Hearts thing where you make your gummy ship all guns. All guns. We need more guns. Yeah, good job, Angel. How old? Are you, how old was he again? Eighteen. <sighs> yes. Nah. He was eighteen. Nah, I don't believe it. Until he produced the birth certificate. It's okay. Uh, Joshua Rakujo is also seventeen, so you know. Lies. Always. <laughs> Then again, you know, anime. I believe Kakuin is also 17. Kyojio is 15. Hey, you look a little under the weather there, Banjo. It's it's because he's so he's mad that he didn't get the smash. Wait, it's wrong, okay. Joe. It's okay. He's not as mad as a uh, Waluigi. Oh no, man. Where the no? We we know that Waluigi gave his ticket to Daisy and then gave it to um, was it Piranha Plant. He's, he's just a hero, you know. Man's gonna die. Oh lord. Uh oh. Kazooie, no! Not that it's too... <laughs> not that that'd be too bad, but... It'd be kind of bad to lose him off of now. Nice, Sweller. Sweet. I'm pretty sure there's a reason for this, but why are the mechs head color different than the body? Uh... It's, it's just, they, they have like certain frames, that sometimes the frames are mismatched. Ah, uh huh. Cause it looks like they ripped the head of a different mech and we're like, hey, get here. It is a little weird. Yeah. I mean, it looks interesting. I just like how the characters, all, like their voiceovers, are also like of the era of television. Like Koji's voice has that little echo, or like reverb. Yeah, it's good. It's good detail. It's nice. All right, so they're not moving. Okay, never mind. <laughs> as long as Gale Force over there stays there, they probably will. <laughs> <laughs> 